I am back for my beginning of October madness, or as I'm going to call it, Spooktober begins, because honestly that's what this is. It's what it's going to be for the entire month until October is over, because reasons. Now, I am starting off by playing Little Nightmares. Again. Why not? Yeah, I'm aware I've played this before. I've played a lot of these games already before, but it was with my old setup. It kind of sucked. So, might as well just redo it with the new setup. Have something more interesting, you know? Okay, sorry, I had to take a minute and do some things real quick, so you're gonna have to excuse me if I don't I have that little minute of not doing anything for a second, although I can just edit that out. I probably will. I'm trying to remember all the buttons. I'd start off with Little Nightmares simply because I normally play through Resident Evil anyway, but I haven't even began my normal marathon of playing through it, so I was like, you know what, I'll just wait until I play through the first two games on my own time and then come back to record. the actual ones that I was going to record this time around later. So we'll start off with Little Nightmares, then we'll do Little Nightmares 2, so we can have both of them in better quality on my channel. <laughs> And then I think I'll play through until dawn, whilst I'm trying to get through the other games also, because these are pretty short, so it shouldn't take me too long to get through this. Hell, I'll probably get through half the game in one sitting. Why are you not grabbing it? Or hitting the button, she's like, nah. <laughs> That's unfortunate. I always say that, but... Eh. 
Also, once again, sorry if you can hear the air conditioner in the background. I know that that may be a thing that you can hear because it's not exactly quiet. And my mic, unfortunately, picks up all of that. <laughs> the only reason it's on to begin with is because... Reasons! Okay. I'm a just... Since I'm not planning on taking my original playthroughs of this off of the channel, I'll just... Ignore the extra areas because I don't really need to bother with them. leave my original playthroughs on the channel. I haven't been doing that for most of my playthroughs, but that's because they've been longer ones. And I think I've just been leaving it alone. S some of my playthroughs. There are a couple games I'm not gonna replay, though, because it took me forever to get through them as it was, so... Well, shit. I ran right into a leech. <laughs> Whoops! <laughs> I said I might get through a majority of this game. I didn't say I'd get through it flawlessly. <laughs> I do love playing these on the Switch. The Switch versions of Little Nightmares is nice. It just feels better to me than playing it on other consoles. I don't know why. I guess it's because I have the portability aspect of it and it's kind of a game you can play on the go. Honestly. But, uh... Yeah! My coffee pot is going haywire over there. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, I could hear it. And now I'm pretty sure that it's picking up on the mic, too. That's hilarious. No, just went by again. I can't wait to see what they're doing with the uh, Little Nightmares 3. I know it's not by Tarzer Studios, like this one and the other one were, but it's still Little Nightmares, and I'm still gonna play it, because when these games first became a thing, I had a borderline unhealthy obsession with them. <laughs> like, a lot of people had a ridiculous obsession with Five Nights at Freddy's. Me, it was Little Nightmares. <laughs> had to be different. Flip. Just because I wanted to see the gnome. I like the gnomes. I can't help it. The gnomes are cute. They're adorable. Hi, Roger. How you doing? You're about to make my life a living hell in a little bit. Fun. <laughs> it 
so funny calling him Roger now. Because, you know, it's Roger the janitor. But when the game originally came out, it was like... They don't really have names. So what am I supposed to call them? And then later you find out the names and you're just like, oh. Why would my light not turn on? I ran into the wall. Oh god. I guess I was like an inch above where I needed to be. Okay. Hide! Is it this way or the other way? It's been a little bit since I played this game. Okay. We don't need to worry about that right now. Never mind. Never mind. It's the other way. Goofy me. keep running into things. That's the one thing, the one gripe that I have with this versus Little Nightmares 2. Hello again, Roger. Bye, Roger. See ya. Don't want to be here. Um, let's see. My goof brain completely forgetting what to do and then looking over and being like, oh. <laughs> I'm terrible. I also keep forgetting to turn my light on. child just getting hungry and so it begins fun fact in case nobody knew but if you're a fan of the series and you're watching this then you probably already know this game was originally called hunger which makes sense Considering that she's always hungry. Thank you. T 
too bad that he doesn't get the favor returned. Don't mind me, just foreshadowing. So, um, for those of you who have been around since the beginning of my channel, I, uh, I started my channel with, um, whoops, <laughs> with, um, the Legacy of Cain series. And recently, during a state of play, I, I, it leaked beforehand, is what I was informed of. But, I don't really look into leaks and stuff, because I just, I prefer to be surprised when things are announced, you know? That's just me. I mean, I might hear some things here and there, but it's not that big of a deal. But, um, I found out when the trailer dropped for the State of Play, the, uh, Soul Reaver 1 and 2 remastered. Which is great, because I... I would love to replay my Legacy of King games again. Preferably with copies that don't glitch out a lot. Because, you know, my copies of the games are so old that they're kind of worn out. Especially Soul Reaver 1. And I don't even have Blood Omen Legacy of Cain anymore. So, uh, yeah, I will probably be playing through those again via the remastered editions. Hopefully, if Soul River 1 and 2 do well, we'll get Blood Omen and Defiance, because then it would just be perfect. That's what I was thinking of. My silly brain was like, I have a lever I'm supposed to pull, and I thought it was down at the bottom for whatever reason. I derped. And it cost me my life. It's okay, though. Like I said, not going to be a flawless playthrough, and if you're looking for a flawless one, then you've come to the wrong place. Because <laughs> no matter how many times I play a game, I will still find a way to mess it up for myself. I'm very good at it. <laughs> I'm very good at just derping completely when it comes to anything. Will you stop? Pushing it? Stop. Stop pushing it. I want you to... I want you to jump up, child. What the hell? Sure, this time she turns the light on. And now you can just 
shadow. Interrupted again. This is getting old, peeps. It's getting old. I am genuinely tired of being interrupted constantly, but you know what? It's fine. And it wasn't even for anything important. It was just interrupting for the sake of interrupting. What the hell? I'm behind! You suck. Another thing I like to state about my recent interruption is that the interruption consisted of the very first thing we said is, you're not recording, are you? And I'm very clearly sitting here with headphones and a computer in front of my face. <laughs> I'm very clearly recording. That made me want to laugh, is what I'm trying to get at. It's like. How are you going to ask that question when the, there's literally everything that is required to do said recording is very visible? <laughs> it made no sense. Sometimes people don't make sense. And I just, I can't sometimes. I just can't sometimes. I was very tempted to actually start this recording earlier today and record the entirety of the game in one sitting, but I decided against it because I wasn't sure that I wanted to do all of that. It's not really important. It's only important if you want to see this. basically just a teaser for the entirety of this game. That's really all it is. It's not that important. Although I believe there was a collectible there at one point. But I've already gotten everything collectible wise in the game, so... It doesn't really matter in my predicament. 
You may have noticed I had trouble getting her to go up the stairs there. She literally got stuck on the edge of the stairs instead of wanting to go up them. Gnomes! The sound design of this sounds so different when you have headphones. Because you literally hear every tiny little noise. I did not mean to fall all the way down to the bottom. I meant to jump. But apparently it didn't register my button. Whoops. I have died so many times already. This is a new record for me. My buttons do that sometimes where they just kind of don't register that I clicked them and I don't understand why. I may need new joy guns. They're just a new controller. I usually just use my Joy-Cons, but every once in a while a controller is nice. Cause you know, I mainly play it via TV, but why are you jumping that way? What the heck? There we go. That was a bit ridiculous. Okay, please. There we go. Now jump down there. And then we get the key, you goofy child. Or she drops the key as soon as we fall down. Also, this game, despite the fact of it having the creepy factor, because it is a creepy game, it's not scary, it's just creepy. Um. It is helping me relax quite a bit. I have had a strenuous, stressful month recently, and it's it's slowly starting to boil over to the point where it's getting borderline unhealthy because I'm stressing out so much because of things that keep happening in my personal life so being able to actually record and me not being tired from lack of proper sleep because of the stress that I've dealt with is quite nice because I'm just I'm actually not tired to the point where it's just boring because I feel like I was a bit tired for the last video I did because of the stress and I think it showed and it the anxiety of that drove me nuts. But I did the video anyway. Because I wanted to get it done. So now I'm doing this and I'm trying my best to... <laughs> She's hungry again, I swear to God, child. <laughs> I'm trying my best to kind of just have a chill, relax recording session this time with a 
nice little game that I enjoy playing. And so far it's working. trap. The obvious trap that she seems unaffected by. Could have gone worse, I guess. was close. Okay, uh, where do I go forward? No, I go up. I go up. Right? Yeah. Up is correct. Sorry, that took me a minute. Creaky, creaky floors. And now the hiding from things begins. myself just a bit. I had to readjust myself. My foot was falling asleep. 
it's all tingly and ungumpy now, but it's fine. I'll live. Maybe. Possibly. Well? Hello again, Roger. How you doing, Roger? Good? Good. <laughs> Sorry, I got a got a bit of a tickle in my ear because of my hair. Yeah, just walk away. Just walk away, Roger. It's fine. Um, six, please. Thank you. There he goes again, little spider monkey.
Throw that there. Thank you. And then up we do. Using bookcases as ladders. Never thought I'd see the day until this game came out. I'm stuck on the rope. Ah, <laughs> oh, good Jesus. Why are you everywhere I go, sir? Why can't I ever have any peace? Keep going. Go on. Go away. Go away, Raja, you're killing me here. Keep going. Shoo. Shoo, Roger. <laughs> you're unwelcome here. Okay, progress. Because reasons. That was my own fault. I should have waited a minute. But I didn't. I got greedy. I was aware of Roger too much. <laughs> I was like, oh my goodness, he's gonna get me. He's gonna get me. I have to go fast. And Boom. I died. Oh no. Well, at least it didn't start me too far away. 
but I wish I didn't have to hit the button again. If only I could run faster. But up, but up, but up, but up, but up, but up. <gasps> no! Why did you freaking not jump? It did register my button. <laughs> I literally hit the button. It was like, nope, y you didn't hit the button. It's, it's, it's not a thing. The button does not exist in anything for you anymore. Camera. Why are you messing up on me now? My camera is being a dipshit. to your death this time. I cannot believe it did not register my button. <laughs> I mean, I can believe it, but at the same time, I can't believe it. That was embarrassing. <laughs> I was about to riot. I think I just peeked my microphone <laughs> accidentally. Despite the fact that I have died multiple times, we are making decent progress. Whoa. I could have fallen there. <laughs> what happened? 
Did I... How did I fall? <laughs> oh my goodness. I have been dying to the stupidest shit this entire time. <laughs> I don't even know what happened there. It's like, I let go of the door. Did I let go of it too soon? Or did I somehow jump off of it? Because I didn't hit the jump button. So I don't see how that would be the thing. Oh, dang it. I gotta do this again. Really? Fine. Fine. That will forever irk me. The whole all in thing. Okay. I know what that is. But that doesn't concern this character. Huh. slide. Why did you not slide? My confusion is immeasurable right now. Why did she not slide? <laughs> Why did she not Slide. <laughs> the loading times. Oh, kidding. Why are you not sliding? Why are you not sliding? I don't understand why she doesn't want to slide. I'm hitting the button. Why is she not sliding? <laughs> I swear, if I'm stuck here just because she won't slide underneath the door, I'm going to be upset. Why was that so hard? Like, 
genuinely speaking. I'm sorry, Roger. I had to do it. I can't progress the game without doing it. I'm sorry. <laughs> it, it's not my fault. The game made me do it. <laughs> I mean, he was trying to legitimately chase me to my death, but... That's a side point. third chapter. Now would you look at that? The chef. Well, one of the chefs. Speaking of which, someone's hungry again. You're always hungry, child. You're always hungry. It just gets worse and worse as the game goes on. It's like normal food. Sure. Have at it. A rat? That's a bit much. So chonky.
like early. That was me or the game. Because, like I said, my one gripe with this game is that you can fall off of edges quite easily. It has no boundary. I don't know if I was responsible for that, or if it was the game. Because it kind of looked like it glitched for a second there. Now I have to wait for you to do your stupid thing. Again. I'm sorry if that gasp of pure exasperation and horror was loud. My camera don't stop messing up on me. Shit. What the hell keeps causing that? It is the game. It keeps grabbing shit. Okay, that was my capture card that time. <laughs> my uh, screen froze for a second there, and I couldn't judge where I was on the platform. On that note, I'm going to take a really quick break. And I'll be right back. Okay. I'm big. And I am up here. I am shocked. I was expecting to have to do that whole sequence again, but it decided to be nice to me, I guess. I try not to fall to my death, which is actually a lot harder than it looks. <laughs> um. I will never understand. 
I will never understand why they need to have the toilets next to each other. That's just weird, bruh. with the key. I don't know where he is. <laughs> Just move on. Good, I guess. Okay, and now for this nonsense. I think I'm just gonna go ahead and go up here and just get all that I need. It's done and over with. If she'll get up here, Jesus. I swear, the jumps are what's killing me this entire playthrough so far. Unfortunately for me, the jumps seem to be my worst enemy. Why is it not going further? Just... Why? It can't be that hard. Say knowing full well that the game knows how to be hard when it wants to be. 
Hopefully, this goes the way I want it to. Like I said, the jumps are killing me. If this were real life, those would have broke. <laughs> Just saying that. No matter how small you are, there's no way in hell that's holding your body weight. But it's fine. Oh, good god. Oh no, I know exactly what this place is. He's gonna come down the elevator shaft. As soon as I pull this. Hi! Bye! No thank you. Go bother someone else. I don't want what you're selling. happened. There we go. For once, they did what I say. I still don't know what that meat is, and I still don't want to know.
All those other falls kill me, but that doesn't... I love how much sense this game has made. <laughs> like, zero sense at all, but it's fine. It's a video game, it's not meant to make sense. little detail there. Bye losers! See you later! I am not sorry. Retrospect, considering how long I'm planning to record for, I might be able to beat this in one setting. And then just move on to the DLC with the next episode. Whoa, I was about to walk right off. Just that one problem that I have with this game, making itself known again.
those guests just pouring in. Ready to make my life difficult. still wonder what went through people's minds when they were making the monsters that you run away from in this game. I mean, I love it. I love creepy shit. <laughs> so, it's, it's not a problem. It's just like why? <sighs> How many pipes and puddles have I gone down now? I yay I, I, I fell off the edge. This is becoming a repetitive running joke at this point. Me just walking off of things and dying. Hopefully it's entertaining. Even if it's a pain for me having to deal with it all the time. Oh, you couldn't have started me over there instead. You'd rather start me directly at the beginning? I mean, I can't say I didn't see that coming, but still. Hello, lady. Can't wait to deal with you again. It's one of the easier ones to deal with, though, if we're being honest. These people are so gluttonous. I shan't be your lunch or your dinner or whatever the hell you want me to be. I shan't. Dang it. She had it and then she fell. I don't know how 
I did that so flawlessly without getting caught once. I normally get caught at least one time doing that. I don't know what happened to make me be able to do that without getting caught. Not that I'm complaining about it, it's just kind of odd. Because, like I said, I normally get caught at least one time. So I have no idea how I manage that. Again. Never fails, does it? looking effect, but that's not how a mirror would actually shatter. Like, I, I love these games. I love games and movies, but every once in a while I'll just notice tiny little details where I'm just like, this... This is awful. This is not how it would happen. Or this doesn't look real enough. Or something like that. I never figure out what he's cutting in there, and I don't want to. I'd rather not know. I can't. That turned around so badly I couldn't see myself. Oh boy, this is a chase sequence, isn't it? Yep. get stuck because she didn't jump on the platform. <laughs> I have the worst luck sometimes. The worst luck. Say no in full well. 
there's a possibility she'll miss it again. Because she tends to do that. Suckers, I shan't be your dinner. And she's hungry again. This child's always hungry. Always hungry. the first moment that made me give up on six within this series. The very first moment she disappointed me and it would not be the last. Looks like I'm going to finish six as part of the story tonight, which will leave the DLC, which is not DLC on this version of the game, because this version of the game came with it already. Complete edition. So creepy. It's such a creepy tune, but it's also oddly soothing. <laughs> like, it reminds me of a mother's lullaby, but it's like a creepier version of a mother's lullaby. And then it just stops when I shatter the glass, and then we go into this room again, and she's just gone. Like, she was never there. A broken mirror. They did a good job with this section, particularly 
because every single mannequin you go past, your brain automatically thinks it's her. Because, I mean, any of them could be her. She makes such a cliche witchy sound, doesn't she? <laughs> Broken mirrors everywhere. Never noticed the way six started to run at this point in the game. It comes to sprinting. when you sprint for so long. the mirror. Fear my power. boss fights in this game are fairly simple. Because, I mean, it, it's mainly just a puzzle game. She's done now. <laughs> Forgot how many times you actually have to do that. Six is hungry again, and I wonder who she's gonna eat this time. I'm kidding, I don't wonder at all because the answer is so obvious. It's still weird though. Walk 
at the end of the game. Or we just obliterate everything in our way. Because I have already found and hugged all the gnomes, all the gnomes show up. If you didn't find all the gnomes, then I think it would only show a few of them. And that is Little Nightmares. Again. <laughs> this time played in full all in one episode. <laughs> I'm kidding, it's not in full. There, we still have Runaway Kids story. Or as the fan bases officially started to call him Seven, which means I call him Seven all the time now because of the fact that the fans call him that. So I'm. I, until I am proven. Until that is proven wrong, I'm just gonna keep calling him Seven. You know? That's just how my brain works. Anyway, I am going to skip my way through the credits because there's a lot of them. On another note, thank you for watching this nonsense because this really was nothing but nonsense. Like I said, I'm gonna play through the Running Away Kids part of the story, obviously, which means I still have a little bit of this game to go. I am also gonna play through Little Nightmares 2, and I'm probably gonna start an Until Dawn playthrough, which will also be a replay because I have played it before, but... I think I'm just gonna do it the way I've done a lot of my other playthroughs, where I just get rid of the old playthrough and then just start it from scratch with the replay. Cause man, my setup back then did not work well with that game. It doesn't work well with dark games, basically. Which is annoying because I play a lot of dark games. I don't know if I'll be playing anything else other than those and two Resident Evil games this year. Hell, I might end up playing more than two Resident Evil games for recording sessions this year. I don't know yet. You'll have to wait and see. 
but I'm assuming I'll just only make it through two of them. But I am going to be recording every single day so that I can upload every single day for the most part. Or at least every other day. We'll have to wait and see how I do it. I'm not sure if it'll be an everyday upload or if it's just going to be every other day. I think I did every other day last year. But I don't know if that'll work for what I have planned. We'll just have to see. You guys will know once I actually start doing it. You'll know. And this is around the only time of year where I upload this much because I'm doing... recording every day because it's October and I like to play a bunch of spooky games for Spooktober. Anyway, I'm gonna just go back to the menu because we're not starting Runaway Kids stuff yet. And I'm gonna end it there. I will see you guys in the next episode of this, because it is the next episode, regardless of the fact that it's technically an entirely different game. When you think about it, it's still part of this game, so it's still this game. Thanks for putting up with my nonsense. Until next time. Bye!